Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I got something really neat to look at today. Now this is a little bit different from my channel. It's more of a kid's toy, but this is so neat that I just couldn't resist getting my hands on this. This is a simulated fire breathing robotic dinosaur by DRC. So you guys can see here, this is a DRC. It is the G18 intelligent dinosaur on this guy. Um, but it has that really neat feature that it can breathe a water mist through a red light to make it look like fire and smoke. And I'll show you that guys that in a second. Now it's got this little rider on top of it and it sings and it dances and it has some knowledge of facts and world facts and something like, I think it may have been like world capitals or something like that. It just all kinds of neat stuff. It reminds me a lot of like the JJRC robots that are out there. I've reviewed a, at least one, maybe two of those over the years. And it has that sim similar aspect of dancing and talking and all that. But this one is a dinosaur, of course, and it, of course, has that fire uh, breathing water vapor. So let me show you guys. We're just going to kind of do everything here at the table, be easier to see. So I won't like take it all around and, and drive it around. It's, you know, this will be easy to do a demonstration here on the table. This is just ideal for a younger kid. A gift from a parent to a kid um, even as an adult like myself this is something that yeah i still think it's pretty darn cool i can't get over the water vapor smoke this looks so cool and it mentions here that it is ages three and up so you know, my five-year-old daughter just absolutely adores this thing and that's one reason i wanted to get this so you have to attach this rider on top if you want to have money you don't have to have them on it and then it comes with a little instruction manual they mentioned his actual name i guess it's carlo and it shows you all the controls inside of here um, you know pretty good instruction manual and all in color let me just show you guys what else comes with it and then i will kind of briefly go over the remote and then i'll do some demonstrations and you saw at the very beginning that water vapor mist smoke so we'll definitely do that as well so inside this bag you get a screwdriver to you know take the uh, excuse, that's the water bottle the screwdriver to take off the uh battery compartment enclosure there to open up the little lid to put the batteries in for both the remote and the lithium ion battery that goes inside of the dinosaur you get this little water bottle and you have to you just squeeze it into like a cup or something to suck the water up into it and then you put it here on its head there's a little rubber spot here and you just pull up this little rubber um, uh, plug, I should say now a spot, and you just put the bottle in there and squeeze it. Now it's already full, so I'm not gonna do it now to overflow. And that will fill it up. And it, it lasted, you know, for quite a while, though it, it, I ran, we did it so much that I ran out before um, we completely drained the battery. And then you get a lithium ion pack. It's a one cell lithium ion. It is a, course a 1s 3.7 volt 500 milliamp hour little thin lithium ion hard pack there a, a little 1s a lipo battery will work just fine that's actually what i got in here so i could show you guys the battery because it just uses a red jst plug which is great you can charge this on a hobby grade charger which i did you know before i uh, started filming this video so the uh little red jst is really handy for charging stuff up and again, like if you, may, if you have some extra packs around like I do, then you can use other batteries as long as they are one cell. A LiPo will work just fine. It doesn't have to be a lithium ion. Then they give you a red JST USB charger to actually charge this up and uh, get that done using a wall or your computer to plug it into it. Then you get this little, um, looks like it's an infrared. See a little, a little light here. Controller for it. Has an on and off switch on the back. And it uses, uh, I believe it's two AAA batteries inside of here. You can see all the controls. You've got uh, your demo, which will do a song and dance. Actually, when you press this the first time, um, you can cycle through like three demos. It plays like Michael Jackson's Beat It. And I think there was, there was one other song that I recognized. I think it was Baby Shark or something like that. And then one that I didn't. So that's pretty neat that they included that on there. And then you got like your sliding forward where it actually like just rolls or you can actually have it walk forward where it actually stomps its feet um you've got um you know it says popularization these are some of the facts geography here uh a twister it's going to do some dancing around some song down here 
it's like a stop it there are volume controls so i'm going to probably do that uh, just to get this down when we first start up because you know it's gonna be pretty loud and harder to talk over a story mode you, you can do the dragon tail and fish tail so different things it does like the fish swimming and different you know, twisting of the tail and it's got you can turn it and then you get the scream here and the spray function which is going to be the fire and smoke and then touch is i think it like tells you to like touch the head and it responds to touching um, of the actual dinosaur so let's go ahead and let's turn it on and then it'll you know automatically start doing some music and some stuff and then we'll show you that fire and uh, we'll do some of the other demonstrations of how you know it does this stuff so now i'll try to remember to do that demo so we can in fact i might do that first so you guys can actually see that music i just don't want it to go taking off on the table so i may have to actually grab it just hold it back because i think this is gonna be the best way to see it down on the floor you have to really get close you know to be able to see everything it's doing really well in my opinion so the on and off switch is down here on the bottom that light that lithium ion or lipo battery goes between the legs here and you have to you know unscrew and pop that compartment open so let's go ahead and uh turn them on hi i'm Kero. and then turn them on here and then let's go ahead and turn the sound down if you go like three presses it turns it off completely and then you're muted so let's go at one so we have a little bit see now he's gonna dance and go around let's do the demo See, now he's doing some sort of a, let's move him. Let's try demo again. I don't know that song, it sounds familiar. Let's try demo. There we go. <laughs> beat it. <laughs> Michael Jackson's beat it. I wonder if they had the license agreement to play that. Yeah, so that's the one. I'm going to press stop. And it says stop, let me think for a while. Now, my daughter was able to get it to do Baby Shark somehow. It could have been when you press any songs. Let's press a few and see. Is that it, maybe? No? I'm not real familiar with the kids' songs, so it's bad being a parent. I should. Let's press it again. It's a lot of kids songs. So you can just cycle through them. Shark, there we go. There's Baby Shark. I don't want to play this stuff too long because some of that stuff there could actually cause copyright uh, infringement on YouTube for playing these songs on there. I don't want to have that happen. So as you can see, there's a couple songs that are um, actual real radio songs from the past or even similar familiar stuff like uh, you know uh, newer stuff i should say like uh, the baby shark so it's a the song mode did that you know i didn't cycle through all of them there but the demo modes definitely plays like beat it um so that's pretty neat uh let's go ahead and let's try the the mist again let's go ahead and do that so i'm going to kind of put it back so we can see i'm just going to press let's do the dinosaur scream first it's just going to do a scream So it just went forward and back, and now it's doing some more neck and tail movements. Now let's do the spray function. And look at that. That is so cool. Just the water vapor that comes out, and it's just, it pours out. It's just so neat. Um, the red light, there's a red light up in here, and then there's that little, you know, the little valve that shoots it out. I don't know if it is, a, if there's a heat element in there. It helps make the water vapor like that you know but it's really really neat um if it doesn't work like while ago i didn't want to go that it had a little bead of water in there and i just took my finger up in here and knocked it away that was that was blocking up the yeah, let's stop them that was blocking up the little the little uh nozzle in there to, to spray the water out so a little bead of water let's go ahead and do it again i just think the the spray is so cool so you can see there and the red light lighting the mouth up like fire. I mean, what kid's not gonna love that? I mean, that's what you wanna see in something. The ingenuity, I really like the fact that somebody somewhere said, hey, you know what, let's make 
a dinosaur that can do this because the robots are getting all to be sent this you know similar this is something that what kid's not going to love not only the lights but the fire and the smoke i mean and if you put this in a lower light well, he's going to start doing stuff let's stop him <laughs> he just tends to have a mind his own at times if you put this in a lower light environment that's going to look even more noticeable with the red light lighting it up but obviously for this video i need to have good lighting so it may not be the red light's not as noticeable but the water vapor looks like smoke and that looks, looks really really great let's go and show you how you can do some right and left turns with them and then turn on this back left you can't the program will let you press that press all the what you want it to do and then press it again and it'll go so you know go forward right go forward I mean, go forward three steps turn right uh go forward to turn left roar you know you can program that in and that's really really neat um so that's something you can do as well uh, let's, here's, here's a head shake and let's do one of the uh, let's do the the dragon tail you see there he's just gonna Ooh, now, he's gonna... <laughs> now he's doing a whole bunch of dancing after that let's do the fish tail that's gonna do the fish like swimming and let's the slide forward again it's going to be more rolling like that and that's rolling back that's just rolling on the wheels that are on the bottom of the feet but if you actually want to do forward here you can actually step and stop it walks more like godzilla which you would think of something like this because of the you know the fire well godzilla's like an atomic nuclear type breath but you get the point yeah Let's see what the twister does. I press the twister, but hmm. almost like some sort of rhyme or something. That's odd. I thought it would have done some twisting dance and stuff. So I think we covered enough on this guy. You can see it's got a little green light here on this little rider, you know, in front. I like guess handlebars, because again, this is supposed to be a robot. So this guy is driving the robot around. This is just fantastic, and this is not really expensive. Let's go ahead and press stop and talk over me. It's really inexpensive. I don't. I want to think it was twenty-five bucks in that range on Amazon, but don't hold me to it. But of course, I'll include a purchase link, guys, down in the video description. This one looks like it may have been originally sold at Kohl's uh, department store because it had some stickers on the side that said that. that us Kohl's all the time carry stuff like this at Christmas time so it may have been left over inventory but this is from DRC who was kind enough to send this to me for review. So again if you're interested in this you can pick this up on DRC's one of their stores. I'll link you to it and you can get it from Amazon in two days if you have prime shipping and it's just it, this would be fantastic for a birthday present obviously christmas has passed now but you know you know you could get an early christmas present and keep it the next year but just a gift to give your kid because it's not going to break the bank and kids are not going to get tired of this my five-year-old wants to play with it and i'm like you know what once i'm done with this video she can play with as much as she wants and the battery life seems pretty good because i'm using a little 800 milliamp hour lipo in there a little bigger capacity it's an old battery i mean it's kind of swollen up and it's, it's not gonna be as good as this one would be and i had not run it dead um playing with it for probably an hour the other day so just a little bitty battery like that it's got great battery life you have to worry about you know going through a pack of double a batteries and something like this all right guys that wraps up the review this little uh, drc uh, was it g18 robotic fire smoke breathing uh dinosaur if you're new to the channel please consider subscribing i got some more stuff coming along i got a drc brushless truck that i'll be reviewing soon soon if you're um new also consider um besides subscribing click the bell so that way you're notified when i upload a video youtube will let you know and you won't miss any videos and as always guys have a wonderful day the power of the dark side, 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 side.